the States, closer to home. We, we, we can't get a flight no, there, we know that. We might have live shots from Virginia, late concerned, on our shores. The South haven't got a great chance because the sun will be rising uh. around that time. We've got The eclipse will be happening in the 8 o'clock hour, which is when the sun starts to rise. Hello again, good morning. Well, it stays exceptionally cold for us today. The bluer the map, the colder it is. Temperatures fell to minus 17 in Northern Ireland last night and minus 16 across Cumbria. Temperatures into minus double figures across many zones this morning. Temperatures much below freezing for most of Britain and Ireland as the day goes on, in fact. So we will see widespread frost, a sharp frost, and icy stretches on untreated roads and pavements this morning. Uh, we're also going to see some dense patches of freezing fog adding to the hazards if you're having to travel out there today. Northern Ireland, central Scotland, through to northern England, the Midlands and the southwest will see some poor visibility for a time. And fresh falls of snow trickling into northern Scotland, the northeast, parts of Northern Ireland, into Anglesey and Wales, the rest of Wales as well. Much of the snow through the west will be concentrated through northern and central Wales, working its way into the West Midlands. Uh, the snow mostly light and patchy, a few centimetres accumulating in some spots, nowhere near the problems we saw yesterday through the west country, and then further north and east, better, brighter conditions. No fresh falls of snow, but plenty of snow lying around, and there will be some sunshine, but it will be cold enough for that snow and the ground to remain frozen. Snow showers into the rest of northern Britain, moving in on a northerly breeze but in sheltered spots where the fog lifts there will be some gloriously wintry sunshine out there temperatures plunging overnight frosty and icy again that area of snow in the west working its way eastwards through the east midlands east anglia and areas of north north london just in time for tomorrow's rush hour we could see a few centimeters of snow bringing some disruption and we could see anywhere between 10 and 15 centimeters of snow falling across higher ground